what's up jake polis today we are going to finish our video chat app and by that i mean that i've already coded the app we are not going to write code here but we, i'm going to tell you what changes have been done and why they have been done so there are four things that have been changed one of them is of major importance but let's first begin with how our app was in the previous video so allow okay so i have to shut down the video capture of my recording software and then reload this and it's working so firstly what i have done is this video will appear in mirror image form so when i turn right the video or me in the video should also appear to turn right which is not happening as of now another thing is that i want a dark theme so here i have included a checkbox and when you will click it it will go to a dark theme and you will uncheck it it will become the background will become white again and let me open another window so that our second peer is also there second peer or second person you can say so another thing is the mute button and i have not made a mute button but uh, when you will click on the second person's video it will automatically get muted when you will click again it will become the volume will become full again and lastly uh, there was a problem in chrome browser if you have seen the initial video in which we built the app from scratch i have told you that in chrome oh, i think the fan is making some noise so let me turn that off and we'll begin okay so in the chrome browser uh, what was happening is this is firefox and when i will uh, close the second person's uh, tab then his video will perfectly disappear like this but in chrome let me show you let me open chrome first what happens in chrome is that it gets frozen when i close the second person so let me open local host okay so i have to shut down the firefox instance and reload this let me open another tab and now when i will uh, close this tab you will see that this video uh, is frozen now and after a while it it will turn black but it won't disappear and what i found in that initial video that the peer close event as you can see it has become dark it has become black the peer dot close event is not working in chrome browser i don't know why so i have used I have basically triggered the remove video function from backend. So let's go and see what changes have been done in our code. So uh, first, go, go, let's go uh, through the CSS part. I've added some things. So for the mirror image, I have used transform rotate 180 degrees. Let me remove this and instead of this style because it is uh, it is kind of become quite large let's move our style to an, a single css file just let me import css and paste it here and in here copy this or this both of them are same and 
in the href plus two main dot css okay so we have covered the mirror part another new thing is the hover here is the peer videos id and then we will hover over it it will turn into pointer it will be, uh, become some uh, opaque and this centered class i have copy pasted it from uh, from a solution i found online and basically uh, what i have searched for was to have a text centered in a image and this works for video as well so this is working perfectly let's uh, see what else so for the dark theme i have uh, made a checkbox and it has a label dark theme everything else here is same let's move on to the uh, javascript part Okay, so we have a reference to our checkbox with checkbox theme and this is kind of the toggle function if it is checked then the background color should be black and this is the HTML color code of black which is the default black of the text so uh, the text will di disappear when this uh, color comes into the background and the mute text will be of white color so if when we will hover over our video uh, there will be a white text in the center similarly here when we will uncheck it our background color will be white and the mute text color will be black okay so what next another important thing is this line uh, what I had noticed in Chrome was when we were directly like last time on the previous code we had it like this so it was directly sending out it was not waiting and I have made it wait for half a second and then call this function because in Chrome an error was coming that our web channel our web RTC channel was not ready so when we wait for half a second uh, it works perfectly and I have added this uh, new text code I should probably have a function to create it I'll do that later but uh, basically what happens when the video is created uh, the text is also dynamically created when it is destroyed the text is also destroyed and what else I think everything else is quite the same in the front end let's move on to the back end okay so what we have done is we have made changes in the disconnect uh, function so when there are at least two clients and someone disconnects uh, so that means someone gen1 which is already in the chat has disconnected so ask the other person to uh, remove his video by sending the event disconnect so here in the front end let's search for disconnect and we'll call the remo function remove view okay here it is so earlier uh this code was inside i think in it peer here i have commented that code uh because this was not working in chrome what i found out that this close function uh was not properly working so we had found a backend solution for that which is by using socket to remove the video and destroy the peer 
so let's just uh, give a comment here as well I'll, I won't remove this code I'll just write it here this isn't working in Chrome so that you guys know that uh, why this change was done and that's pretty much it so let's go and run this app and see it in action okay so let me start our server let me first shut down the previous server and open this one so oh jeez so as you can see that here is a little checkbox nothing fancy this is oh, pretty bare bone and when I will check it it will become in oh, dark theme and when I will uncheck it this will come back to white again and now the video is in mirror image form so when I will turn right it appears in the video as well that I am turning right and let's open localhost okay so here since there is another video here you can see that when I hover over it, uh, my cursor turns to pointer and here a text appears that click to mute and unmute. So right now you won't be able to hear anything because in the recording software I have uh, muted the desktop audio. But as you can see here, uh, you can see a speaker signal that means this tab is making noise. So when I will click on it, it should disappear because the volume is now turned to zero as you can see it has disappeared and when I will click on it again to unmute the volume is back again so this is perfectly working and this text is as I've told you in the code that it generates dynamically so when the video will be removed this will also get removed also when it is in dark mode the text will become white so dark mode and this is in white so that it is visible okay so now we have covered I think the three things and let's uh, open it in Chrome and see if the major issue is fixed now or not I'm closing this and opening Chrome localhost and here also it is working fine okay so this working and let us just apply some oh wait a second let me close this so this should perfectly this is perfectly removed and also let's apply a Dracula filter so what I want to test is when I open a new tab it when my video appears this video there it should wait for like one half a second and this Dracula filter should be applied so localhost and it has been applied so this is good and I'm let's let's apply a filter here also black and white or old school and it's working when I let us delete let's close this tab now so it is perfectly removed the player is closed and destroyed so uh, I've updated the github repo and the live link you can uh, it is in the description you can go and check them out and I won't be making any more updates on this video chat app this is very simple and I hope you all uh, were able to learn something new from this and if you like uh, this content this these types of videos uh, don't forget to hit the like button share this with your friends who are also in programming and 
uh, subscribe to my channel doubt everything so this is all for this video guys see you in the next video